So the, the SOA governance framework was developed by a, a group of very dedicated uh, open group members. And, and it was taken from best practices from different companies and from different work that the members have done. And it's there to help organizations setting up their SOA governance practice. The SOA governance framework has recently been approved by ISO as an international standard. So the SOA governance framework consists of two different parts. A reference model for the SOA governance, which contains SOA governance processes, information used in SOA governance, and guidelines. And the SOA governance vitality method. This method was designed to, to uh, adopt these processes and information and guidelines in, in the governance framework to fit the maturity of the organization that was using it. And the vitality part of it means that the method can, should and is rerun regularly to adapt the SOA governance framework to the maturity of each individual organization as the maturity increases. So why should, should you bother about SOA governance and SOA governance framework? It's a, it's a tool for you to set up your, your organization and to make sure you develop the right services, the right SOA solution at the right time, with the right performance, the right security. So it's a tool for you to use.